Disclaimer, if you're easily offended by any curse words, I suggest not finishing this video. But if not, I hope you enjoy the video, and subscribe. Hello everybody, my name is Ripplewar, and today, I have for you today, uh, some free-for-all on Call of Duty Ghosts, and, uh, actually my first ever, um, commentary on my channel for Ghosts, and uh, I guess I should, I guess I should say my first impressions on this game, and for the most part, this game is really fun, even though I don't play it that much anymore. Uh, I don't I'm, actually I don't really play Call of Duty in general anymore as I used to. Uh, I've kind of grew out of it, but I do play here and there um, most of the time. And uh, see, basically, this game overall is very fun uh, for me at least. And uh, but one thing I do uh, that irritates me about this game is the spawn system. Uh, how if you're either just like starting out in the game, or like starting out in the game, or if you just killed someone. Like, they would spawn either, like, right behind you or in front of you or something like that. That's just, that's kind of annoying to me. But, um, uh, yeah. And I, as, like, I, I realized as I grew, I grow up from my, and more, uh, I mature, uh, I realized that I'm actually, I don't play Call of Duty as seriously anymore. I play, I just, like, more laid back. Uh, I'm more, you know, just... Subtle, I'm not competitive or anything. I just like I just love playing games for fun nowadays. And uh if I stop uh any time during this commentary, I apologize. I just have my food right in front of me. Uh I have my chicken, rice, and green beans. And uh prepared it all myself too. With the help of my mom by telling me uh how everything is made. And I must say, I did a, uh, I, I did a very precise job for myself. I could say for myself since I cooked it. Uh, with the chicken, I had, like, um, salt, pepper, and some kind of spice, garlic, par per parmesan or something like that. I don't know exactly, but something like that. If some chefs out there know what it's called, then you know what it's called. But something along that lines. And, uh, yeah, the rice... Very, uh, was prepared very precisely, and so was the green beans. And uh, many of you may not know that, well, actually, I don't think any of you know, um, I'm very hard on cooking nowadays. Uh, I I love to cook. Uh, I got into cooking, actually, at a very young age. I used to uh, help my mom cook uh, here and I, like here and there and everything. I think it was usually, I think it was usually, baking. Uh, I used to have like this little, uh, I think it's called an apron and a chef's hat. Uh, I thought it was really cool back then. And then, I, then I grew out of cooking and now and now I'm actually getting more into it uh, as I mature and uh, grow up. And uh, I think cooking for a male is a very a good trait to have. And by what I'm saying this is by um how most men or teens nowadays rely on women to cook for them, which, um, is not, well, is, I just find that kind of, uh, I don't know how to explain it, but I just feel like if you, you're a male, and then I think, uh, cooking would be a good trait to have. Oh, and yeah, there, and this game, this game is not special at all, um, like I said, I just play for fun, and so basically what we have here is one of those uh, try-hard guys. Yeah. And uh, for myself, I'm not like your average teen, I guess I would say, by how um, you, they would say, like, how like how, te how basically teen males um, talk to uh, um, like teen girls nowadays, uh, and how they would say, Yo, what's up, bitch? You know, you want to go out something like that? And no, I, I'm not like that. Um, I'm not like that. I was raised to... I was raised properly, and uh, how I treat women is I, I respect them and their priorities and everything. Uh, and how... Just, I respect them in general, so I, I, I like... Just either just talking to them generally or anything like that. It's just okay with me. I'm not going to, like, pressure them to do anything. But, uh, yes. So, I'm not like your average teen. Uh, I, uh, just basically... I'm... 
I guess I'm a, a rare kind of a rare person. Uh, um, basically, uh, I get told a lot that I, uh, I'm very kind and I have a kind heart, and uh, I don't. Uh, I'm either too soft or anything like that. But um, yeah, it's just I guess it's who you are. Uh, I guess it's who I am. Yeah. So th this this commentary is not scripted, by the way. I'm just going on as it says. As a uh, yeah. So basically. Yeah, I'm not the I'm not just the right. I guess I'm rare of a teen, I guess. But uh, yeah, I guess that's who I am, and uh, who I always be. Yeah, but uh, thank you for joining me uh, on this commentary. Well, I guess it wasn't really your normal commentary, but uh, it was my commentary. So thank you guys very much for watching, and uh, I will see you all later. Take care.